the man who grabbed my arm in Central Square. I can still feel your breath. Hot of lust. Your eyes, my reflection in them. There I am, a snack. Crumb underneath your nails. Boys like you are the reasons why my mother always says a prayer before I leave the house. And I can't help but think that you must not know that I am kin to knives. My mother, a butcher knife, chop heads like onions for flavor. My grandmother was a sword who slayed dragons like it was child's play. What people don't know is that my family has a long history of sexual assault, but their chests have always been catcalling the grope. Did you know that women and children in Porter Prince are more likely to be sexually assaulted than any other city in Haiti? Did you know that every family member on my mother's side lives in Port au Prince. Did you know that UN peacekeepers are running child sex rings and impregnating women, rewarding the bodies with peanut butter on single slices of bread? The Janila Jean, 18, pregnant at 16, belly swollen with peanut butter and baby, said, and I quote, sometimes I imagine strangling my daughter to death. Do you know that my mother is always worried that she's beginning to lose her memory, forgetting that she called to ask where I am only 30 minutes ago there are always taste buds ready to bask in our blood. The ground is always ready for our uteruses. Every morning, we sharpen the tip of our blades before leaving the house because who's to say that today we won't be mistaken for a spoon or a silver platter? That our comb won't be mistaken for an open door? Who's to say that our chests won't be calling that day? My mother wears two layers even on the hottest day of the year. Her upper lip is beaded in perspiration. When I was younger, she dressed me in layers. Thick socks and tights, the back of my knees were always sweaty and I'm so like my mother. Always alert, always ready to stab at any threat. I guess mother like daughter. I guess grandmother like mother. I guess every woman like me, I guess we always have to drown in our own discomfort for safety. My mother has made me a machete, both knife and axe. She knows I'll have to protect myself from a lot more than just men, that my handle will be a lot more important than my smile or my brains or my feelings. And it's true that my family's history has always been a secret that all the women tuck into their bra straps that every girl born is sharpened into a knife. Man of Central, I hope I am making you very uncomfortable. That my skin is all of a sudden a sea of maggots. That there is an open wound where your manhood once lied. That you hear the sound of my laughter slice you open over and over and over. <laughs>